And we'll say here is an enemy sprite sheet. It's 10, 24 by 10, 24. I just looked in the properties for that. And it has five rows and five columns. I'm not going to tell it the exact like dimensions to chop it out. Let's just tell it this and see uh, what it does. So 25 enemies total. I want you to create enemies this and let's see I also have a sprite sheet or excuse me a sprite sheet I have a JSON of enemies here of various properties and rewards you know what this might be a better one for the bigger agent here and I have this as a text file so let's plop that in there let's bring this over here Let's bring the enemies over here. Let's get rid of that. I'll take my prompt, cut it, paste it over here, create enemies from this and the properties from the JSON text that is also attached. That should be good enough. Let's see what it does with that. We're gonna give that to the agent probably cost me like five dollars for this change or something the agent has uh gotten a little you know not a little a lot more expensive since uh moving over to this i don't know if it's just verbiage with what it's you know being called or if it's actually is doing a lot more behind the scenes uh, or if it's really kind of the same implementation i guess i'll trust them and think that they are doing a bit more with agent three behind the scenes Okay, let's go back to the other tab for Pixel Pulse, and it's still building things out, as we can expect, and it'll be doing that for a long time. Okay, and it's creating the system here, and let's see what it comes up with. 